Hey, so I'm just going to do a quick video on how to clean non-carpeted stairs. Um, this might seem pretty obvious, but you know when you mop stairs and you use a regular um, string mop or whatever kind of household mop you use, um, it usually will push kind of the hair and the dust into all the corners and stuff. Um, and even if you sweep or vacuum your stairs really good first, you seem to always still kind of find that stuff hiding in the corners. So um, while we do sometimes still use a string mop, okay, I have an audience. Get. Uh, I recommend using a flat mop. So this is called. Oh, well, you're gonna see it upside down. It's the one mop. Um, they sell this at Surface Science. I think the website is surfacescience.ca. But if you look up surface science cleaning products canada then you should get this website and they sell these one mops um, in a kit and the kit comes with the handle which is ergonomic which we really love actually and um, it's extendable and the base you can interchange the different sizes and the base is really easy to put on and take off it just kind of clips out in and out and then the reason I originally started buying these was because they come with these reusable but also disposable mop pads. So of course we don't throw them out, we wash them and they last a really long time. And they are about $1.25 each, whereas most microfiber mop pads cost around $10, $15 sometimes, depending where you get them from. And these can be used dry or wet, so we use these to dry sweep floors before we start mopping and they're awesome. They collect all the hair and dust and then we, we can also use them for damp mopping. So um, <clears throat> I'm going to show you this part in a minute because my suggestion for cleaning hard floors is to clean them by hand and the reason for this is so that while you're going down the stairs you can wash the kickboard and you can really get into the grooves on the whatever this is called, and you can wash the baseboards as you go down and you get right in the corners and kind of bring any dirt and hair you find with you as you come down the stairs. So we would always sweep and vacuum the stairs first and we would use this and this is awesome because it, it's also really pointed in the corners. So when you're sweeping you get right in the corners and bring everything down. So on and so forth, but I've already done that. And then I just want to take whatever floor cleaner I'm using. We use the same all-purpose cleaner we use on everything. Um, it's so it's properly diluted, so it's a neutral pH, um, so it's safe on all surfaces. But um, one thing I, I recommend when cleaning floors, if you have wood furniture, then you want to keep from running your mop along the edge of the wood furniture or counters. Um, or even like just stained wood baseboards because over time, over years, it will start to wear away the stain. So that's where a good flat mop comes in handy because it doesn't um, get a bunch of water along the side of the wood every time you clean. So to clean the stairs, I just, myself, just spray a bunch and as I go, And I'm getting right into the corners and bringing anything with me that I find there. And then I'm just pressing my cloth into the edge behind this part here because that's where all the dirt likes to collect. And then if I see any spots that I need to scrub, I'm just going to scrub in there. And if you wash floors often enough and um, do it well, then you won't have to scrub your stairs a whole lot. And then as I'm going down, of course, if this area needs to be wiped, then I'm going to do that. So this way, rather than struggling with a string mop and trying to get trying to get every little bit of hair out by flicking it out at, or using my hand to push my mop into the corners, I can clean these stairs in five minutes. Um, just go slowly and carefully because you are going backwards. And then this is why I wanted to show you this flat mop as well because. <coughs> The, 
it's not going to work for everybody to crawl down your stairs on your hands and knees. So I, I realize that some people need to be able to stand up to clean their floors. And this is where a great flat mop comes in handy. So um, there's tons of flat mops out there. You can buy them anywhere. Um, I've already told you the reasons I like this one. It's super affordable. Um, it's in Canada and the, the shape of it makes it really good at cleaning for you. So when I'm doing wet cleaning, this is already pre-wet, so I just got it wet in the sink and wrung it out and it just makes wet cleaning a little easier. Um, and then I would do the same thing. I would spray the floor. It just doesn't get quite as into all the little corners and grooves as you can with your hand, but it just still does an awesome job. And these are really, really awesome for cleaning any type of shiny floor, like um, any hardwood floor or laminate that you find is really hard to clean because it's always shaky, or uh, porcelain tile, glass tile, anything like that. These are awesome, but most flat mops are. It's just we like these because of the the pads are so inexpensive, so you can switch them out often. Like um, on these stairs, I could switch it out twice, and then I would always have a nice clean bed. So if you have any questions, please send us a message or leave a comment, and we'll do our best to give you the best answer we can.